Okay, so I'm showing you today a little preview of a series I will do. I'm showing a MIDI foot switch controlling DMX lights using QLC Plus as my software. So if you look on the left side of the screen, you see my computer. Uh, I've got the uh, QLC Plus virtual console up, and we'll get into all that in further videos. But uh, this is basically your, your lighting controller right here. Uh, if you look on the right side, you'll see a foot pedal here. So this foot pedal is sending signals to all the light changes. You can see I'm, I'm moving back and forth between different scenes here. Let's hit the blackout. So using QLC Plus, you can program the lights to do things like uh, uh, chase lighting, having a, a certain color, how, how bright it is, all that kind of stuff. And you can control that with lots of things, but I'm using it here with a MIDI foot switch. I have one of these left over from uh, a guitar rig that I used to have. Got it used off of Reverb.com. Uh, so uh, I'll put some links there in the video so you can kind of check out the gear. The uh, light right here, uh, real basic light, so Monoprice Pi LED. Uh, so it, you know, it does all the basic stuff. You can see here I'm switching between different colors, red blue, kind of a white color there, a much uh, bigger blue, got some strobe lighting here, uh, got the pinwheel going, and you can see all of this is controlled by the foot switch because I programmed all this stuff, and if you're looking at the screen, when I press the foot pedal, you'll see the uh, solo button that I've configured light up, so let's see. Let's go to another bank here. So uh, you can see th this is a chase right here. It's a 700 millisecond load time. That's a, li a little longer. This one is about uh, 12 seconds. Uh, that's my kind of purple color right there. Anyway, uh, so some cool stuff you can do. Uh, I'm running uh, QLC Plus on Windows 10. You can also run it on a Mac. You can run it on Linux. Apparently, you can run on a Raspberry Pi. I'm a little interested in, in doing that for maybe some stage stuff. So the goal here is to uh, control our lights with a lot more flexibility than just leaving it on an audio chase when we get back to doing gigs. Uh, so we can have this foot pedal with us on stage and, you know, just press it. So if we're doing a ballad, you know, you might, you might want this light for the ballad or, or a slower song. But if you're doing a, a rock and roll kind of song... You might want to have, you know, something like this going on for the rock and roll song, or you can uh, set it to do audio chase through the MIDI foot switch, and it will uh, play along to the music. If you want to do that, you might want red, so on and so forth. Uh, so let me show you a, a cool piece of gear that kind of enables all this from the PC. Uh, you probably can't see it here, but uh, it's called the uh, Mini Open DMX. It's Urillo Pro. Got it off of eBay. Uh, it's like $31. Took about six weeks to come. It's coming from another country to the USA. So very cool piece of hardware, and that pretty much enabled my computer to talk to DMX lights. And then uh, the MIDI adapter and the MIDI foot switch here uh, completed, completed the uh, setup. So now I can do all this. Uh, I need to program more of the lights. We have a couple of light trees that again, we always set on audio chase and just let them do their thing. So this would be kind of cool that we can uh, get some configurability. But, uh, you know, stay tuned for more videos. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. I've got lots of uh, things I can show you about this. It was really easy once I kind of understood how the software worked. Uh, it, it does take a little bit of understanding how the software functions and how it communicates by DMX. But once you kind of get that, you can do a lot of cool things. So I didn't see a lot of people on the QLC Plus forums. I haven't seen a lot of videos on specifically doing this with a MIDI foot switch. So I am going to do more detail on that to help everybody out. So make sure you subscribe for more detail on this and to check out all my other gear and uh, you know uh, musical things that I'm doing on YouTube. Thanks a lot.